This is private property. Get out of here. Lady. Private property, I said. No, toilets are closed. Not allowed to use them. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Project Zomboid and Carl's not such a good situation out here in the woods. <laughs> he has been lost in the woods, yes. And uh, all he has is a sleeping bag that I don't really know how to... Oh, that's how you use it. Well then, okay. Can you can you sleep in the tent as well like that? It's a good question. Yes, you can. Well then, you guys should have totally told me that. I'll have him sleep for a while. Probably gonna get jumped by zombies. But that's okay. At least he's not tired anymore. To be honest, I should have. Uh, you know what? Pause for a second. We have a digital watch. All oh, right, you can't do anything with it, but but of course not while it's paused. Um, set alarm. Oh, okay, he already woke up. Never mind, you don't need an alarm. Good, he's in minor pain. Dude, this is perfect actually. I don't need the sleeping bag really. I'm gonna take the tent with me. This is actually really good stuff. I don't need the sleeping bag now that we know how the tent works. So he's not tired anymore. He is in minor pain due to probably sleeping on the ground. This would be my guess. Yes, he has neck pain. But I think we have some painkillers, right? Take the pills, bro. The fact that he didn't get jumped by zombies is legit. Now. I think I should follow your advice. You guys told me, Coco, this is dangerous. This is stupid. Get back to the gas station. Go upstairs. Sleep there for a bit. Read some books, learn some stuff, and then it's gonna be easier for you to survive out there in the wilderness. And you know what? You're fr freaking correct. It's definitely true. I should totally do that. I might have walked into some zombies. I hear more than just one. Yeah, there's two. I don't know if it's smart fighting them right now. But I don't want them following me back where I'm going. There's, I'm sure there's gonna be enough zombies over there. These guys can stay in the freaking woods. <laughs> we have found and killed so many out here, Jesus. We are on day 9, 411 zombies killed. Yeah, I would call that quite a lot. We weren't even that far from the road. Oh, it's like right here. Jesus. Uh, how, somehow I thought we were way deeper in. Well, you know what, this is fine. Oh, uh, the gas station is down here. And yeah, we have cleared this place out enough. We have plenty of food, especially with all the MRE stuff that we have. I really shouldn't be concerned about going and returning back to the wilderness. You know, the way I wanted to. I shouldn't be concerned about that. I should just be happy that we have a temporary place, which is not exactly safe due to the fact that all the bro uh, doors are broken down. But we do have some extra doors for the upstairs, you know. So, there's definitely that. Oh my god. <laughs> All of these could potentially move in here. But I guess the lucky point over here is they don't move in groups. So, they are less likely to come in in one huge horde. That is less likely. But I would like to kill some of them before we go to sleep. Like, he has slept a bit. So, he is at least not tired anymore. Which means he can do some killing. And if they come one by one, hell yeah. How's the quality on this baseball bat? Lady, give me a second. Okay, it's still pretty solid. I'm sorry that I called you a lady. I, I tend to do that. I do tend to do that. Alright. <laughs> Working as intended. Army boots, we don't need that. How's our skills? Long blunt getting out there. X also up there. Maybe it would be smart to go maybe kill some of these that are back here. That might potentially bang on our windows during the night. Because that would be unfortunate, you know. Having these guys be banging on our windows causing issues. I love these one-shot kills though now that he's not so tired anymore. Pretty good. And that he's not fighting the freaking forest where there's trees everywhere and he can get stuck. <laughs> Oh, look at that. 
More cigarettes. Don't need that uh, gum wrapper. Thank you. Alright, the pain has definitely gone away. Okay, it's it's 10... it's 10.20. 10 10.30. It's probably time we be retarded in our chambers. I mean, we retire in our chambers. As it should be. I did leave that door open. Well, I didn't think I'll return, so... It's probably not so smart. Did I leave this open as well? No, this was always open. Hello, anybody in here? I can't see shit. Alright, we're looking better. Uh, let's go sneaky. And let's close these curtains. So they don't any get any ideas of maybe coming in here. I don't know if you have any extra curtains, but maybe you should put them... Yeah, there's a dude right there. I should definitely go clear him out. Before he comes banging on my door. Hello, sir. More people might hear this. Which would be unfortunate. Kitchen knife, I don't need that. Alright, just looking and listening if there's any more. So far, so good. Okay, just keep on being stealthy. We never searched this. Do I have anything? No, I don't have any curtains or something. I could lock the door. I don't think that's necessary. Also, I very much doubt any zombies made it up here. So, um, I should be fine. We have... We have books to read and all that stuff, right? I should be happy that we have this. You know, bicycle repair manual. All that good stuff. <laughs> Industrial mechanics textbook. Yeah, I think I did drop or not check some of these. Um, that's fine. Oh, I did take all of these. That's that's okay then. Let's, uh, let's fill our water bottle. It's gonna be 11. Fairly heavy load with that water bottle. Ready? I mean, we are carrying quite a lot. Put the painkillers in here and it's gonna be fine. There you go. Easy money. And the matches. And the alcohol wipes. Don't need none of that. We can still carry just a tiny bit, but we are really mostly full. Good. Uh, did we... That's definitely didn't, sl didn't sleep in there. <laughs> we slept in here, right? Get us in here. And we have some of the extra books that I can read. The appliance repair manual, the Celtic folklore... Uh, the other ones I did read, so that's good. But I think for now, I'm gonna have him go sleep. He can wake up in the morning and do his thing. I think that's gonna be... That's gonna work out well for our good old Carl. And you don't need... Hey. No, no, no. Close curtains. He can't. Never mind. Go to sleep then, bro. Coral! Why do you wake up with a freaking nightmare? I mean, I guess... The bad part about sleeping out here is all the zombies that are gonna be out there, huh? They're just gonna be chilling, and then he's gonna get the panic attacks, which he did. Uh, not so good. I'm pretty sure he won't be able to go to sleep. We can we can smoke, so he's gonna be at least a bit less anxious. And then uh, I don't know, eat some. He's really not gonna be happy about these, huh? Drink packet. Thirst and unhappiness. That sounds just bad. These MREs, they're supposed to be awesome. They're not so awesome, are they? Cherry snack tarts, eat that. He needs to get... Uh... Wait, right. So, I'm gonna have to do something about that. Drop the cigarette butts on the ground. How did I get over here? <laughs> Cooking for intermediates. Bronze working textbook. I don't know if you're gonna need this, but okay. So he's not tired enough to sleep, which is bullshit. Because now he's gonna be tired in the middle of the day. Oh, here we go. Ugh, zombies out there. You know what? Um, keep reading the eggs book for now. Why not? Sure. He needs to read a bit more. We're gonna we gotta have him read. There it is. He read the whole eggs book. So, that's worth it. And he's getting hungry again. It's 6 in the morning. He couldn't sleep at all. Now he can actually sleep. Amazing. Eat some peanut butters. Peanut butters? Just peanuts. Not peanut butters. That doesn't make sense. But yeah, eat some peanuts. That should make you happier. And now, let's go check what has transpired downstairs. Because we know there's zombies chilling around. And, uh... 
If we are to stay around here for a bit longer, we do want to clear them out. There's a good chance they've done some door busting. Doesn't seem like this door has been compromised. Do you have anybody inside? Any customers? No customers right now. That is always good to see. All right. Well, if we are to live over here for a bit, we should really do something about the doors. Not that we can build ones, but uh, maybe we can block them. Block the front, and then we just have the entrance to the back or something like that. But yeah, we definitely do want to clear these zombies out. Like all the flies are not going to make him healthy. <laughs> Wow, good start. Good start. Okay, well, the music is correct and amazing. Actually, you know what? Switch to switch to the X right now. Which, since we do have the XP for the X, let's go for it. Actually, that those X swings seem very slow. But you know what? Let's go. We can we can level up our X. We have the we have the big old multiplier. Go for it. We can keep the baseball bat for something else. We level up? Was that maintenance? Did they get maintenance up to two? I think so. Does that mean we can make that flail now? Oh, dude. I think we do. I think that's the one. Oh, that'd be legit. That'd be legit. Sir, please don't come over here until I kill this one. Thank you. That's nice of you to wait. Hell yeah. X level one. Let's go, boys. That's perfect. All those multipliers are gonna help. And I know I did say I wanna save these axes for actual stuff, but now that we have the full-on multiplier, I kinda wanna rather save my baseball bat because that is my best weapon currently. So I'd rather keep that one strong. Oh man. The woods are alive with the sound of zombies. I need to go check the, the back side of this whole thing as well, because there's probably a bunch back there. We did see that lady just walk through or walk by. I don't know how long we'll be able to stay here. Due to the fact that there's probably going to be a helicopter event happening soon-ish. Uh, and that's important because... I mean, we are carrying all of our stuff right now on us. So it's all going to be good. We, If we need to run, we run. Actually, finding a car would be legit. Uh, eventually. I don't know if I can. Somewhere out here, because I've really not seen any freaking cars at all. Oh, that guy has a maggot. Definitely want that maggot. Sorry. Sorry, sir. Just picking up a maggot. Don't worry about it. There you go. I know, I know. You guys have said stomp on them. Oh, there's a... It's a main highway over there, huh? Interesting. I, I still I don't know exactly where I am, right? This is uh, this is a completely unknown part of the map for me, and to be honest, that's fine. I I think I like that. Maybe you can just put some boards on this, on the doors over here, and the windows downstairs. Just board it up. Although that would be using the precious nails. The nails will be precious whenever we decide to build out there, you know. Okay, so there that lady that was passing by. Truly was just passing by. Nothing interesting. Uh, but definitely do want to clear out the back. The back room needs to be cleared out. So you guys come on over here. Indeed. If we are to stay, we should clear you out. There's also plenty of places we could search out here. 100%. Uh, please, you two. One of you fall down to the ground. There you go. No. Not allowed to get back up. Like, we have plenty of these to, to search. Maybe there's a car somewhere out there. Having a car would be legit. Also, I don't know if uh, change the, changing the the setting for uh, the helicopter to sometimes still makes it that it's gonna come in fairly early on. So I didn't want to pull you both, really. I just wanted to have one of you come at me. And especially not have you both bunch up like this. It's really unfortunate. Come on. Alright. You know what? If you want to play like this, I'm going to play like that as well. There you go. That's what you get. Oh, there's a pistol. Not that I want the pistol. It's really not going to do much for us. 
besides call in some more zombies. I know we could install silencers and all that stuff, but to be honest, that's more uh, that's more of a well, not my thing exactly. Beta blockers. Want them? Don't have space for them. I guess we have space for them there. But yeah, those beta blockers are gonna help with all the panic moments. Can we just go around over here? Looks like the fence ends over here. Alright, there's definitely more ladies. I have no idea where that lady went. The lady that we seen during the night. Maybe it was just his imagination. Always take the matches as well. We're gonna need these eventually. And as you can see, the X skills are going up. 100%. Okay, you know what? Screw it. Let's go. Let's go explore a bit out here. I did not kill that person. That person has been dead before. Let's not eat the maggots. Okay, fine, lady. Let's do this. Not that I really want anything from these places, to be honest, because I don't think they offer me anything that I want. Besides, of course, the maggots, which we can't actually pick up anymore. Hmm. Maybe I'll just drop the MREs. I know, I know, there are a lot of uh, calories and are exactly the most amazing survival kit that we could hope for. But he also doesn't really like them. Uh, I was trying to open the freaking door. There you go. Open that. Lady. Lady, come on. Stay down, lady. Stay down. It's just one of you, right? Swear to God, if one of them comes behind me right now, that'd be unfortunate. Also, I tried to push her and hit her at the same time, and that didn't really go well. <laughs> Did not really go well. Alright, now we're looking better. Uzi magazine on this corpse. I mean, this is America, after all. I'm not surprised these guys had an Uzi on them. Or if they had an Uzi on them. For now, just magazine. Is there anything in here? Does one believe? I don't believe there's gonna be anything amazing. You know what? I did find nails in the other one. I should go check out. And I should eat more of these. Cherry snack tarts. Whatever those are, we should eat more of them. Because my boy's hungry. We can't have Carl be hungry. Carl, let's see if you can jimmy this one. Hell yeah. Easy money. Alright. Bathroom zombies? No bathroom zombies. Good. No good stuff out here either. Alright, well, there's a potted plant. Maybe you can take that one. Anybody chilling in here? No, just long socks. Uh, it's not gonna be winter, so we're, we're okay. Wait, with the empty cattle, we can make a helmet, right? No. No, not, the, not with that one. Lots of canned food that... We don't have the space to take, so... Cranberry juice. You know what? Drink all of that. Enjoy your life. We have plenty of food over here that we don't really have a chance or way to carry anywhere, so... Just enjoy it, since eventually you're gonna have to probably eat maggots. Actually, no, his scavenging skills are pretty good, so I really shouldn't worry about that. Just drop this. Alright. He's still anxious, dude. Why are you always so anxious? You know that smoking is bad for you, Carl. You know what, lady? I'll take this. A shotgun silencer. No, fuck it. I'm not gonna take it. I mean, I'm not gonna use shotguns. It's uh, it's not something I want to do. It's, uh, it's not Carl's uh, way to live. He's more of a pacifist, as you can see. <laughs> more, of a, more of an axeman and, and bat and all that stuff. Weapons, you know, guns and all that stuff, they, they can be fun and all, but I think what really would be the most fun thing to do is build a freaking flail. Yeah, build a flail and go ham. Alright, uh, we got friends. You know, friends in need are friends indeed. Let them break. Is that is that all there is out here? This is the whole trailer park? Ooh, look at those cornrows, damn. Wow. That's impressive. I would like to have that haircut on Carl. You know, he's, he's seeing new things. Vitamins. Take those. Like he's uh he's learning how to become uh in in the nineties. It's like nineteen ninety three, I think this game is happening. Something like that. I was uh I was three years old back then, so 
don't remember much of it, but uh, I hear it was fun. Fun times. <laughs> we can't really get in. Yeah, we can't get in through these windows. What, call, what could possibly be found in there that we would need, huh? I don't know. Also, I did never live in America, so I wouldn't know how America looked in 93. So, yeah. Let's chill. Uh, excuse me, people. Wait in line. I see there's one more coming. They are definitely not waiting in line. That sounds like there's somebody behind me. Yep. Alright, you guys wanted to have the bat? You get the bat. Sir. Sir. You get the bat. I guess now you get the axe. Because it's just one of you and you have an afro. Good, like, outfit. I gotta admit, they're making these guys a lot more colorful. I don't know if this is a lot with the mod I'm using that uh, adds a lot of like more clothing, but I do know they added some extra stuff. Bandana. Ah, okay. Hey, can you put it on the face? Wait, where where was that? Put it on the face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that. Carl, the bandana master with a scarf as well. He won't be able to breathe, but who cares? And that bandana made him over encumbered, but of course it did. Of course it did. Gauze? Mink Medical Lab. Improved Band-Aid. Improvised Band-Aid. We can actually make this? Oh, we need a, a tape and all that stuff. Now we're good. Now we're good. And you have boxes. Oh, now I know what you got boxes for. I definitely want this. Um, it's one kilo, though. Fuck. You know what, cockroach? It was nice knowing you. We'll eat these. This drink package just seems awful. Yeah. Uh, chewing gums are not really heavy. Tetris. It's inventory Tetris again. Is this how Americans slept in 93? Really? These things? Wow. I mean... Alright, I guess it beats sleeping on uh, inside of your car or something like that. But still, come on, dudes. You can do better than that. I guess. <laughs> Making a bed in the forest. Could somebody leave your doors unlocked? I would appreciate that. So my boy Carl doesn't need to go through every freaking window. He feels like a burglar already. Nobody out here. Why did you guys break so many windows? What is wrong with you? Like you have perfectly good doors out here. Phone book. Boredom reduction plus 50. I love that. Oh, that's awesome. Plastic textbook. This doesn't give you anything. Literature. literature, literature. Uh, we do want this. Yes. Carpentry for intermediates is definitely something I want to take. Of course, we can't carry it, but we'll take it. Uh, let's remove the book cover out here and let's see what we got. Uh, foraging for beginners, which we don't need. Alright. Can I drop this one in here? No, we're completely full, huh? Yep. Yes, we are. Uh, he's getting drowsy, of course. It's... Yeah, it's middle of the day. It's time to get drowsy, bro. Uh, I wouldn't have it any other way. But that's how it is. You know, you had to look at all these rotten foods for so long that... Yeah, get drowsy. That's fine. You know what? We searched the trailer park. And I don't know if there's any more trailers out here. It doesn't seem to be the case. So, at least... You know, we, we got some stuff out of it. The auto manuals are always good to have. Saw some zombies moving down there, but they're fine for now. Maybe I can actually store some of the stuff so I don't carry all this crap on me constantly. I mean, we do have the banana. Which is just really over-encumbering us and not giving us anything. Yeah, it's fine. I'll drop it. How about the scarf? It does have scratch defense, so I'll keep that. 100%. Sure. Okay. Well, we got another book that we can't read yet, but like I'm, I'm really confident that the intermediate book for carpentry is one of the very, very, very important books that we're gonna need. And uh, do we just take a nap? Like we have definitely cleared out this place acceptably well. Acceptably well. Uh, I would. Maybe like to put, since we do have a couple of nails, maybe these planks, just just board up these doors. Can you actually board up the doors just like this? No. 
Uh, so we'd have to put something over there. If you can. Let's see, can we put this freaking fridge out there? Let's, let's drop this on the ground. These are all empty. Now, if I pick this up, too heavy for inter inventory. Yeah, we're full on stuff. Mm, probably can't pick up any of these, can I? Would too be, be too heavy. I need electrical three. I mean, I can try, even if you fail. I don't care. You know. Oh, do you actually need electrical three to try pick it up? I thought it might have a chance. Okay. Uh, never mind. What if I try something else? We don't really need these doors out here, do we? What if I try picking up some of these doors? Okay, there's just a dead lady in there. Pick up the door. On the floor. I need the door. Can you not pick up the door off its hinges? Like, that doesn't make any sense. Excuse me. Yeah, just floor. Mm. I can disassemble a door. That doesn't mean much to me. Okay, so those things are not really useful. What else could I use? These boxes. I think they can walk over boxes. Okay, you know what? Let's drop some of our inventory somewhere. Uh, maybe one of these boxes and then I can potentially move the other stuff. Oh my god, there's so much in here. I'll find an emptier one. Alright, let's see if we can do this now. I did drop most of our stuff in there, so it would be easier for us now. Yeah, we can do this. Excuse me. Pick it up. There we go. Okay, pick up the large fridge. Oh, it's in two pieces, huh? Uh, and each piece is 40 kilos, so let's, let's take one. Transport it there. On the ground. Throw it on the ground right here, where the carpet is. We're gonna do the same with the other one. Try not to break your back, dude. Try not to break your back. He's tired now. <laughs> 3 p.m. Tired, yes, yes, why not? What could possibly go wrong? There you go. So now, can we... That we're here. Uh, do I need to have this in my inventory to try placing it? Okay, let's try doing that then. Place. Right there. Oh boy. Oh boy, okay. Now that's better. I appreciate that. Come shopping, you boys. Come shopping. I can I can go out on the on the back side. I should also probably board these windows while I'm here. Hello friends, how do you do? Anybody around here? Doesn't seem to be the case. Uh, would you like to give me your plank? I'd like to have some of these planks. Put them on some of these windows. Just, you know, in case anybody really wants to get in. It's uh, maybe gonna prevent them a bit. You know, just just saying. So let's barricade this one with one of the planks. We have a couple of nails. We have a hammer. We have no carpentry skill really. Actually, we did get some carpentry skill by now. It's not so bad. There he goes. This is not gonna give him much. I don't think it actually gave him anything. But anyway, at least it's gonna stop them a bit longer. How much longer? Uh, not much. We would need more planks, which we, I guess, can get by destroying more stuff out here. That's that's definitely the truth. But as long as we can barricade some of these downstairs windows, uh, we should be doing fine. And put some uh, American flags up. Maybe IBC in the back. I definitely want to take IBC with me. There's some. This is something we need. Like, really, really an awesome thing to have. And I should not have left it back there last time. Harmonica. I mean, of course. Birdcage. Flower. I'm still disappointed I can't wear this freaking Santa's head. It's like the worst thing ever. I think the cigarettes as well. We're gonna need those forever. Can of fish food. Yeah, don't don't eat that, maybe. Canned tuna, though. That seems nice. Uh, just, just open a canned tuna and, uh, and eat it. Hell yeah. And, yeah, I know, it's 4 p.m., you're tired, I'm just gonna go upstairs, have him read books, 
Maybe till like 8 or 10 and then sleep. Look at this madman. At some point he actually woke up at 7 in the morning like a normal human being. After reading the electricity for beginners in the evening. Well, you know what, Carl? That was pretty impressive. It is very foggy outside, holy shit. Yes, it is. Uh, he's also anxious. I was afraid he's gonna have a nightmare again. And he's getting bored. Uh, I mean, why not? Why wouldn't you get bored? It's, uh, it's a very boring place out here, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, well. Cigarette butts just all over the place. It seemed great. I did find a sheet for this window, by the way. So we have that. Let's, uh, let's drop the book in here for a second. The reason why I was uh, reading this book is because we can then go and disassemble all kinds of electrical stuff out here in the nearby houses and level this up. So we're definitely going to need a screwdriver for that bad boy. Now let's see if we got any customers overnight. It seems like we are quite fine. I like this. Perfect. Uh, we're going to go out in the back side. Actually, your package. Let's have something to eat. I don't actually have any food on me, which probably is a mistake. Since, uh, you know, I'm probably going to be running for my life soon. So... Uh, this... Is something that's against boredom, please. Anything? Peanut butter? I don't know. Uh, let's get a chewing gum. Yeah, dude, that sounds like a great food in the morning. Chewing gum. And then some marshmallow cereal. Eat it all. That should make him happy and full of stuff he needs to gain weight so if you can do that we have to do that awesome he's now full of bursting he's gonna have all the power in the world to go and smack things now zombies out here seems clear all right now uh, let's take stock of situation we are on day 10 and 22 hours so almost day 11 447 zombies killed pretty impressive still no helicopter but definitely plenty of neighbors still moving in. And uh, we should definitely give them a good old hello. Try not to get killed in the fog. That would be amazing. And continue working on the X scale. I was contemplating maybe reading uh, one of the other books. Like for Longblade or Spear or something like that. But in the end I decided maybe Electrical for now is going to be more useful. And in the long run as well. We can always, you know, fight zombies to level up. But of course, that way we can level up faster. We need to get our sprinting and uh, all that stuff going up as well. I don't think there's books for that. I don't think there's a book to tell you how to sprint. Lady. Sir. Whoever you are. It's foggy out here. I can't see that well. So please, one at a time, boys. One at a time. You know, this has got to be scary. All you see is just silhouettes out there in the in the fog. You know it's zombies. They don't move that much. They just stand there. Ominously. Or something like that. Oh, it's got to be... It's got to be freaking pretty... Pretty freaking scary. Freaking pretty, yes. <laughs> That's the word. The bird is the word. Okay, these guys are close-up neighbors. Don't Don't want none of those. I wonder if we can level up. I think we can level up the axe to uh, to level 2, actually. And after that, we're going to switch back to... I think I should just switch to a quarter stuff. You know, keep on working on blunt without actually using the good baseball bat. That'd be smart. Also, I thought there was one more zombie that I can't really see right now. So, you got to be careful. You had a sharp, sharpened screwdriver. And not something we really want. Like, knives and such as weapons, since the build 41 changed the way those insta-kills work with a knife, it's not something I really use anymore. Back before that, I did. I did use it a lot more, you know, the insta-kills with that, but now it's not so good anymore. But that's okay. I'm, I'm happy using blunt and axes and all that stuff. It, it's satisfying. <laughs> to just smack everything. And I really should check if you can now make a flail with the maintenance skill. Dude, I should check that. Um, I will. Let's just... Let's get the let's get the axe to level 2. That's all I want right now. Let's get the axe to level 2. Yes, it's probably going to break this soon. But let's do this. There's neighbors out here that I don't want out here. So, 
That's just an excuse to get our ex up. Oh, my ex is leaving Texas. That's why I hang my head in Tennessee. Still no level up, but we are very close. Very, very close. One of these will have to do it. I wonder if there's more places down there, more uh, things we could search. Come on, who's gonna be the Tennessee? That's gonna be her? No, it's gonna be all of them at the same time, of course. I asked for one lady. And you bring me three. I mean, I can't complain, can I? But yeah, that's a, that's a level up. We are on level two in Axis. I'll finish you up as well. And then we're gonna switch away from the axe again. What was that over there? Magazines, you say. Probably a really useful item to pick up. I'm not the one to do it though. Uh, give me my quarter stuff, which we don't have on us. Okay, let's uh, let's go back in there. We're switching back to quarter stuff. And then I need to figure out how to make a flail. I think that would be my next goal. Look at that, with maintenance 6 you can make iron flails and all that stuff. Maintenance 4 is bronze and copper spike flails with copper ingots. Oh my, oh my. <laughs> so for this one now we need stone, we need a rope and a sturdy stick. I think I can make them all. Uh, rope I can make out of like thin rope. Let's see, uh, I know that we can. We'll, we'll do this. I, I want to make that. I want to make a freaking flail. I want to use it. This is my goal today. I'll figure it out right now. Oh, 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 oh. Hello. Hello, sir. I'm just trying to forge over here. Jesus, that was so close. I was foraging on like speed too. My, oh, my. <laughs> we got friends. Okay, I was trying to find a stone. Because we're going to need for sna uh, for snail. <laughs> for for our new weapon yes for our new snail weapon but uh we found everything else but a stone and then these two guys came in here all right all right so you got acorns what can we do with an acorn make tannin plant acorn uh for now i'm just gonna get rid of that we got some beech nuts we got some mulberry leaves which we really don't need to have chestnuts though Cra crack nuts with a hammer uh yes Crack them nuts. 100%. Let's, let's get some nom nom. Dangerous uncooked? Really? I mean... Okay. Uh, we need branches. So let's make me those. Rosebuds? What can we do with that? Yeah, get, get rid of this. Don't need of that. Uh, so tree branches. I can make... Bark strips. There we go. Make me bark strips. That's the one we want. Okay, we're gonna need more branches for more bark strips. The only thing I don't think we can make is a sturdy stick. Because I think we need a saw for that. And uh, we don't have a saw out here. At least I don't think we do have a saw out here. If we do, well, that'd be great. Um, there might be one in one of those boxes. Also, I swear to God, oh, I see a zombie right there. See a zombie right there as well. Start foraging. Take it easy and slow. I know this can make you tired, but yeah, he already sees me. What a trucker, dude! Why? I'm just trying to forge over here, okay? Trying to find a stone so I can kill you all. All right. This is what I'm trying to do. I'll go kill that lady up here because I don't feel safe. Yeah, it's not a lady. <laughs> it's a full beard lady, don't judge me. Yeah, oh, of course. Of course, that's the dumbbell lady. That's the one that was next to the river. You. You bastard. I don't know how somebody stuck that through you, but... No. You almost killed me a long time ago. It's a salvage warhammer. Right there. That dumbbell thing. Well then, we can use that. It's probably very slow. So we don't really want to use that. Now, I swear to God, if there's more coming, I'm going to be mad. Let me just freaking forage out here, okay? Where's my 100% forage ability? So we found no stones yet. I don't want to really forage for too long, because I know he's going to get tired if he does. Grass, not something we're going to eat. 
I don't think it's needed. Uh, we got we got some more branches, so at least we can make more bark strips. We gotta need a lot more than what we have. I guess I could just chop a tree and get a branch. That would have been easier. But I still need to find a freaking stone. Okay, no flowers needed, thank you. So now we have 15 bark strips. Um, we're missing one thin rope. No, actually, we needed... No, we just needed uh, one rope. Right, right, we're good. Okay, no, we're fine on these. So I need all I need is a stone, and I'm gonna need the sturdy stick, which I think we can only make by using a saw. So I guess now it's on me to go check if there is a saw actually out here, or there's no. Uh, lady, excuse me. This is private property. Get out of here, lady. Private property, I said. No, toilets are closed. You're not allowed to use them. Oh my god. You ask and you shall receive. <laughs> she had a freaking saw on her. Exactly what I was like, yeah, we probably don't have. I'm gonna need to check. She had a freaking saw on her. This is legit. This is destiny. The game wants us to have a freaking flail. I love it. Just need a stone now. Which apparently might be harder to achieve than you would think. Disassembling these tables out here gave me exactly what I needed, which is a plank. And after the plank, I can now make a sturdy stick. There you go. I think it's gonna make a bunch, right? He made eight. That's that's fine. Uh, all I need now is a stone. So all we need to do is get lucky while uh, looting out there just to get a stone. Which you would think it's easier than than it actually is freaking stones don't seem to be just growing everywhere which is obnoxious but um oh well i mean he's just bad at this now all of this food like it's dangerous uncooked i can't really do much with it right now because it can't cook so you know i'm gonna drop these and let's see if do we have any actual food that is not mre out here we have the soda I don't want to drink the soda, to be honest. What else do we have? Chewing gums, but of course. Eat them all. You would think we'd had more food. I mean, we do. We have the MREs, but... you think we actually had any proper food. It's not disgusting MREs. Actually, I'm pretty sure we do. If I go loot some of these places. We have more canned stuff. Like canned potatoes. Jar of pickles. Pad bowl. Wall tech radio. See, these we need to dismantle eventually. Soviet Union flag. I think uh, it's time we take this one. Represent our true colors. Box of solid fuel cubes. That sounds actually great. Can you dismantle this? We can play with camera. Um, does that make you happy? That probably makes him happy, huh? Okay, he stops playing with it once we move. Interesting. Canned tuna. That's exactly what we need. Doomsday prepper bag. Oh! <gasps> Okay, crazy weight reduction, 100, low capacity though, I will take it, I will actually take it, Jesus, I don't think I ever found that before, but that seems, that seems great, that does seem great, I mean if you equip the secondary, have that bag in here, it doesn't actually show, but uh, if you put the saw in here, does it actually have any weight? How does this work if it's 100? 0 0.8 weight. Okay, if I take this out, how's the weight on this now? 0 0.1. So it does... I don't know how it works. Uh, I might be just weird right now. Uh, and mind, mind, uh, mind fuck myself, but... Let's, uh, let's leave it be. Uh, I will take this with me because it seems good. If somebody knows exactly how this works, well, do tell. Because, I mean, 100... I guess it's not percentages, right? Anyway, uh, Soviet Union flag. Please, unpack. And I need to place this? Why can I not place this? 
Excuse me? I was pretty sure I can place this. Add flag to a pole. Oh, I can only put it on a pole? Oh, man. Well, fine. We'll just uh, put it out here so we all knows, uh, everybody knows where it does belongs. Anyway, for now, thank you for watching. Next episode, we go on a quest to find a stone. Yes, I know, exhilarating and all that stuff. Amazing, beautiful. Uh, but that is the quest. That is the quest that we will try to accomplish. And hopefully we will. Now, where's my electricity? There it is. Tonight, we read more of this. And then we have the metal working to continue. And uh, tomorrow, we find a stone.